everyone. Thank you for staying tuned. So I'm going to show you an in-depth walk around video of this 2020 Ram 1500 Sport. So it's in this beautiful white pearl. So it's not just a flat white, it actually has a little bit of pearl shine to it, which is really nice up close. You're gonna have the black accents throughout the vehicle, giving a really sharp contrast. You're gonna have some parking sensors down here. Coming off to the side here, you're gonna obviously see it is that 5.7 liter V8. It's gonna be able to tow anything, up, you know, just over 12,000 pounds, which is really nice. You got the 22 inch wheels, the black side steps, you know, like I said, it's blackout edition, so it's going to have the black uh, emblems here. It's going to have a proximity key. Beautiful coloring throughout. On this side of the vehicle, where you can't really see when we do the inside video, you're going to have, obviously, the power seats, um, the pedal adjusters right here, auto, uh, automatic lights, as long as it's on auto there for you. Okay. You're obviously going to have the nice crew cab, which is really, really handy. You're going to have some storage just right underneath here. You're going to have the bins as well in the floor. You have your converter as well in the black back as with the USBs. Okay. Again, nice hard hard shell ton of cover, which is really really great to have. You're going to have the hitch receiver and your wiring harness. Easy open tailgate, which is really nice. This is your backup camera right here. I'm going to show you the interior shot, so stay tuned. Hi everyone, thank you for staying tuned. My name is Sarah and we are in the 2020 Ram 1500 Sport. So continue kind of on with the black detailing on the outside. You're going to have black leather throughout this unit here. Quick and easy, um, clean for any kind of spills, pet hairs, things like that. You're going to have tons of storage, obviously, in the doors. There's side pockets right here. You're going to have the upper kind of glove box and the lower one. The lower one does lock. You've got big old consoles right here so you obviously have a little bit a little tray comes with a usb you open it and you can actually adjust this which is really nice it's just right here goes up and back there's dividers in here so you can truly customize it right here is actually where you put your cell phones for kind of storage which is really nice you also have another household kind of 115 volt converter just right in there okay so super customizable which is really nice this unit is a push button start. Um, you also have a built-in remote start there. So you just make sure your vehicle's locked and then one, two, your vehicle's gonna start for you. So you don't have to worry about that, especially kind of with Canadian winters, right? Going above, you're gonna have this big panoramic sunroof, which is really nice. Those are actually very rare right now because it's dealing with the chip shortage. Okay, so all the controls are right here. You have your assist and SOS buttons as well. You have a universal garage door opener that holds up to three different garage doors. So if you're working a lot and that kind of thing, you can have your home and an office as like a shop as well, okay? Got your instrument cluster. You can change this middle to kind of customize what you want to see. So whether that be fuel economy, speedometer, things like that. It also gives you a lot of information about your vehicle, like if your tires are low, that kind of thing, okay? Steering wheel right here. This button right here will change that instrument cluster, okay? You have your Bluetooth. You have your cruise control. You also have your gear limiter and your brake controls as well. Behind the steering wheel, you're going to have your audio control. So this controls the volume. This would control like the source kind of thing. So if you wanted to switch out, you don't even need to actually move, remove your hand from the steering wheel. You could just do that while you're driving, making it true hands-free. Okay. You have automatic four-wheel drive, or you can choose what kind of drive mode you want to be in. Okay. And then comes right here to the center console. So like I said, you have your brake controls right here for your trailer. Again, it's going to tow over about 12,000 pounds for this vehicle. Okay. Couple buttons right here, so if you don't like the parking assist, that kind of thing, you can actually turn them off, right? Uh, you can select your toy hauler when you are haul hauling anything. You have dual climate for the driver and the passenger, so no more arguments about the temperature in the vehicle. You have heated seats, ventilated seats, heated steering wheel. These are all buttons, but they're also all going to be on this touch screen as well. Okay, so you have Sirius XM radio with proper subscriptions, AM, FM radio. You obviously, like I said, you have the climate that is the touch screen bunch of controls here so like I said you can have that backup cam you have your heated seats your ventilated seats and your steering wheel okay your apps is going to be kind of like your services so your assist your wireless hotspot that kind of thing all with a subscription base which is really nice and there's a bunch more on this side as well navigation as well which is really nice you know uh, if you're driving it's actually going to tell you like if there's an accident things like that this unit has 44,000 just over 44,000 kilometers you want to take it for a test drive, give us a call here at Cinema Dodge 780-458-8660.